Hi there, class of 2024 parents. Uh, I may have some um, 2025 in here too, actually. Just want to talk to you about the SAT and your plans. Um, you know, we have a lot of nice spots open still for the prep for the June test. Uh, like to have some, some of you probably, your students should take the prep. Um, you, some of you are under the mistaken notion that under no circumstances is preparation for the SAT actually needed. Uh, but if your student has a GPA above 3.3 and they're going to be applying to schools out of state, they need to take the SAT in hopes of getting some merit award money. And I'm seeing this year, a lot of our seniors didn't do that and it's affecting their awards and where they'll go to college. So you really need to think about that. But there's a, that's a major thing that I'm seeing. You need to think about the price is right for us. Yes, we're going to be online. We're going to try to do the drill work for each prep in person. But the central classes will be online. And then the drill work will be in person on Saturdays and some evenings at our cathedral site. Uh, so uh, it's an excellent time for you to think about the June prep. Uh, and get your student into that. Um, right now, I can hold the prices still low uh, for that prep. There's also going to be an SAT prep for the August test, of course. But, um, you know, I don't want to see you miss the opportunity uh, to have your student in the June prep. Secondly, uh, yeah, you do need to think about your youth schedule. Uh, some of them are just way too busy to do uh, prep. Um, and that's a signal to you that they're probably going to be too busy to start early work on their applications. And uh, we're here to help with that, but I keep seeing schedules being too busy. Um, they're working, they're doing things for school, uh, they're, they're doing enrichment programs on Saturdays, and you want to sign them up for the prep and you want them to do applications. Conduct a reanalysis of their schedules is what I would uh, highly suggest for you right now. And let's uh, make sure they're not overcommitted. But at the same time, really consider the SAT if their grades are high enough. If they're not, then they're just going to probably, as far as an affordable college, be looking at a CSU. And even then, it's going to cost you, you know, uh, 17, 18, 19,000 out of pocket. Um, or unless they go locally, then it's almost nothing out of pocket. Uh, so, Start thinking about the role of SAT and all this and, and the fact that you need to um, think about preparing your youth for that test too. All right, get a hold of me, um, you know, at the email address. You know my email address, but I put it below here uh, right in the captions and I'll put it in the uh, comment section as well. God bless you. Hope to hear from you soon. We got about, let's see, we have four signed up. So we got about seven spots, maybe eight that I'm willing to fill for that SAT prep. It's in May for the June test. I'll put the link down below to our schedule on our website too, but it's Saturday and Sundays for our prep, 9.20 to 10.50, Saturday mornings in the afternoon on Sundays, 2 to 3.30, uh, sometimes 2 to 4. We'll have drill work during the week in person. We can work with the students at that time. All right, thank you much. Hope to hear from you soon about SAT prep if you find it's something that you'll need.